When it comes to buying a weekly planner for yourself, there's a lot of great choices. So today I'm going to give you a few simple tips for making the right decision. A weekly planner is a great planning tool for those of you who like to see your whole week at a glance. Perhaps you have an appointment driven profession such as a lawyer or a doctor or uh, maybe even a salesperson who has lots of appointments and you want to be able to see where you need to be throughout the week. It really helps you to make your priorities. For those of you on the go who don't mind having a smaller planner, um, you want to look at one of the maybe checkbook sized or, or pocket sized planners. They fit real nicely into your attache or your briefcase or even your pocket and they allow you to plan anywhere you are. You can flip open your schedule on the go and it makes staying on top of your schedule real easy. If portability really isn't a factor for you, maybe you spend a lot of time at a desk or maybe you have occasional meetings, then you can go with a large size planner. It gives you more space to plan, plenty of room to write. Now there's also medium sized planners that sort of go in between there. They offer portability plus some more writing space. Next, what type of planning are you doing? Do you just want to keep track of your appointments? Then there's a simple format for that. It just shows your weekly schedule. Or you may want to track your tasks and to-do lists. There are formats for those. And then there's also um, formats that involve note-taking. Perhaps you're somebody who really likes to write. You have a lot of meetings and phone calls you want to keep record of. So there's a, a format for that as well. And finally, what type of planner matches your personal style? Do you like something with a more durable cover because you're just out and about? Or are you looking for something that's a little classy, professional, um, board meeting type styles? Then there's a, you know, some fine leather covers that are good for you as well. Or maybe you're just the no-nonsense, budget-minded person who just wants, uh, doesn't really care about what it looks like and you just want the really good quality planning uh, formats. So those are the three factors that will help you choose the right weekly planner for yourself. I hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your time.